Well guys, we're back in the S550. Let's go ahead and start it up. Here we go. So we're gonna go out to the meet tonight. Uh, we're driving the S550. I'm sure a lot of you guys want to see the GT500 in action, and I do too. If you guys missed the last upload, we actually blew up the transmission on the GT500. Unfortunately, it sucks, but uh, we are sending out to Ben Calamer. He's going to be fixing the transmission up and building it uh, to a stage two spec. So I'm really excited about that. I'll have all the details in that other video, so go check that out. Uh, and once again, MustangLifestyle.net, go support the channel, pick up a cool uh, t-shirt, and it really helps us out. Um, I'm going to have a promo code right here. Just go ahead and, and click that or use that on the, uh, the site. And yeah, it helps us out. It helps you out. And I really, really want to be able to do a vehicle giveaway um, here within next few months it just depends how the finances and everything go so i'm really trying to start some uh, more merch uh, it's a lot of what a lot of other youtube channels do um but yeah let's take the s550 for a ride um obviously you guys know i have some issues with my knee but um i was able to drive the gt500 i think the triple disc in that is actually lighter than the s550 clutch that we have in here but i think we'll be perfectly fine so let's go ahead and jump over to Mexico. So if you don't know, this car is very loud. We're just letting it warm up and it's it really is nice to be driving stick. I'm just gonna close up the windows here for a little bit, let the car warm up. But we're gonna head over to our Wednesday night meet, uh, meet up with some friends. We might go burn some tires, maybe probably not in this. Um, I wanna keep the tires on the rear of this, but we're gonna go head over to the meet, uh, check out some friends' cars, maybe go for some rides, and uh, just really have some fun. I really, really want to take El Chapo, the GT500 over there, and maybe get some reactions. Uh, I really want to test the 60 to 130 with a draggy. Um, because I really think it'd be in the fours um, on there, but you know we didn't we didn't get to do that. But um, you know, good old reliable S550, 60, uh, 65,736 miles. We got a stock MT82. Now we called up Ben Calamer, and I have always pretty much thought to myself, we're gonna have to talk to Ben Calamer at some point. And I thought it would be for this transmission. 800 wheel horsepower, bone stock MT82, 65,000 miles. I really thought that this MT82 would have been toast by now. And But no, the TR6060, which granted we're making a lot of horsepower, 1,100 wheel horsepower. If you missed the dyno video, go check that out. Uh, but we managed to destroy a TR6060 and it is what it is. But we're gonna pull the trans out Saturday, get it shipped out Monday and hopefully get it back as soon as possible. And I'm really excited about it. I talked with Ben a little bit. He's gonna uh, film a little bit of the teardown and what he finds wrong, uh, you know, with the trans and yeah. Uh, I think I'm feeling a little, a little fun. Turn traction control off. <laughs> Jesus. This thing's a rowdy little car. You know, don't, don't count this thing out. <laughs> oh man, what a freaking beast. You turn traction control on. You know, I will say traction control is a bit annoying sometimes, but if you guys noticed the other day when I drove this with traction control on, we were actually being able to move. And then you see traction control off and this thing is a spin monster. We have Nitto 555R drag radios on the rear and there is no freaking chance. It's all about that horsepower 
and uh, yeah, I mean, Gen 2 Coyote is really one of the best engines. You can put a lot of power to it. You could daily drive this car anywhere and actually, actually, actually daily drove this car for a long time, um, which is why the car has so many miles. I mean, it's been boosted since 36,000, 34,000. When you guys can check the video and, and see, uh, but it's a beast. It is holding up like a champ. So, and if we ever had any engine problems, we'd be heading over to Modular Head Shop, rod, piston, and build, and get this thing back going, make like a thousand or something. Um, obviously, your only uh, pitfall is this transmission, um, but this car is an absolute blast. I hope you guys like these uh, driving videos. Um, sorry. <laughs> I don't think we'll have any traction here, but we'll try. Yep, <laughs> still pretty traction limited. Um, it looks like a nicer surface here, so I just wanted to, you know, test it. What a beast, man. What a freaking beast this car is. Just an absolute blast to drive. It's pretty loud, too. <laughs> Never a bad time in the Whipple S550. And this is an old, uh, this is an old Gen 2 supercharger actually too. So I hope you guys are liking the content lately. Um, I mean, doing the best to put out what I can. And uh, yeah. take a test trip in this um, there's been a little bit of changes to it yeah just a little so you're gonna see how she rips what's up guys Nick here Andrew decided he's gonna let me take the uh, Whipple s550 for a ride show her what uh something quick sounds like because you know well, not sounds feels you know what I mean you ready mm -hmm. all right
too. RF3 is a quick car. He got the hit on that one. <laughs> Burn the tire. Stitch that on. We'll snap that bad boy back in. 